We begin tonight with Walter Morris. He is live outside Reagan National Airport, where, Walter, we hear there were a few issues today. What happened? Well, Sean, uh, all of the travelers we talked to say they were actually surprised by how easy everything went here. Now, you can see things have calmed down a lot, but they will pick up in just a few hours. It's always like butterflies whenever we get to have time together. For many like Matthew Lindbergh, emotions running high moments before takeoff. His wife is in the Air Force and stationed in California, and he hasn't seen her in months. So he made sure he got to the airport with plenty of time to spare. Definitely worried about this why I got here like three hours early, just for that. Many air travelers across the DMV getting the gift of smooth sailing as they head into the holiday weekend. And coming in, it doesn't feel like it's necessarily the few days before Christmas. What about now? Thursday, marking the official start of the year-end holiday travel period. TSA projects they will screen 2.5 million passengers nationwide every day until January 2nd. Yeah, I mean, feeling good. It actually doesn't feel too busy right now, um, but yeah, we're excited that we're going to visit some family. According to the flight tracking website FlightAware, throughout the day, only a handful of delays at local airports like DCA and Dulles, along with countless happy reunions. I'm so happy. I'm so, I don't know why. I'm speechless. I don't know what to say now. I'm so, so, so happy seeing him. The holiday cheer so high for some families, even the Grinch can't steal their joy. First question, why? Uh, because I'm meeting my sister. And she deserves to be horrified. It's my Christmas gift to her. Talk about commitment. Fresh off her flight from New York, Gabrielle Tandet suited up to give her little sister a big surprise. Known to be a bit of a Christmas Grinch, not always in the Christmas spirit. Perhaps taking other people's presents is appealing. I don't know. I don't know. She got me a Grinch sweatshirt last year because she thinks I'm a Grinch. And I was like, you think I'm a Grinch? I'll show you. <laughs> and she did. She let News 4 tag along for the big reveal before heading off to spend the holiday weekend in Arlington. And thanks to an easy travel day, of course the Grinch has pre-check. This Christmas is already off to a great start. I'm, I'm celebrating the holiday in my own way. We'll see if my heart grows any sizes. <laughs> back out here live and so again tomorrow is expected to be that peak travel day before christmas so if you are flying out you want to give yourself extra time reporting live at dca walter morris news for i'm glad the grinch didn't you know <laughs> cause any that trouble out there for anybody uh, she's got full of you know a lot of energy going on out there <laughs> walter thank you